Hi everybody, we're going to paint our salt dough Easter eggs today, okay? So what we need for this activity is we need our salt dough eggs or salt dough creations that we made. We need some tin foil, we need paint, and we need some paintbrush. As you can see, I have my tin foil where I'm gonna put my paint. I have my salt dough creations. I have a cloth just in case, a cup of water, some paint brushes, some Easter color paint, and I have a little bit of glitter too. If you have some glitter, you can take it out at home too, but make sure you ask for help so you don't get glitter everywhere. Not everybody likes glitter as much as Miss Morrow does, right? So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna decorate my Easter eggs. Now you can decorate them however you'd like. Maybe you wanna add some patterns, maybe you wanna paint them all one color, maybe we wanna have some polka dots. I'm gonna go ahead and start painting and I hope you guys have fun painting your eggs too. I can't wait to see how they turn out. So I've put some of the colors of paint that I know I want to use on this piece of tin foil here in front of me so I don't have to keep getting out more and more paint. <laughs> an orchid for your mommy and an Easter bonnet too. Oh, here comes Peter Cottontail hopping down the bunny trail. Hippity hoppity happy Easter day. Here comes Peter Cottontail hopping at him stop and listen to him say try to do the things you should maybe if you're ex well that was super fun i'm really happy with how my decorations turned out i think they look really good i bet yours look awesome too i can't wait to see some pictures of them where are you gonna put them? Do you think that we should leave them up as Easter decorations? Maybe we could find an Easter basket to put them in. See you later.